A couple of weeks ago, I called my dad and I said, you know what? I've been thinking about this thing and I wonder if it's possible. It's probably not possible because it seems like it would be really hard. But is it possible to make a foldable metal boot jack? And he said, let me think about it. A week later or a week and a half later, the prototype of the foldable aluminum boot jack. Let's get to it. I can't wait to show you guys. Check this out. Twisted Willow Fabrication foldable boot jack. Folds out like this, then the leg comes down like that. Boom, boot jack. And you can travel with it. And it's aluminum, so it's only about a one and a half pounds. This thing is epic. Like when he sent it to me, I said, geez, this is so simple. This is not what I had in mind when I said foldable boot jack, but it's perfect. It's way better than anything I could imagine, which is why my dad is the designer and the fabricator and I'm not. This is incredible. I mean, check it out. We got aluminum everywhere, okay? We got stainless steel parts and this is a, a torque hinge so it's tight but it's not going to slip when you put your boot in there and I'll show you guys in a second okay and we got the leg here bam that comes down and also this polyethylene plastic to keep the boot from scarring so a lot of times you'll see wood or leather here so you don't get gouge marks or scuff marks in the boots when you use these things but polyethylene works just as good if not better because it will last forever okay this is recycled polyethylene so it's lasts forever from things that were already made before <laughs> so for real this is so cool I mean what do you guys think about this look at how that folds okay I'm gonna give you a little bit of a a little bit of a uh, demo here. I'm just gonna switch the cameras. All right, here we go. So as you can see, we have the this is we're calling this the Try Easy Boot Jack. It's named after the first two lines in my song. Uh, voices in the overtone so try easy boot jack so you just take it you unfold it here see and then you have your leg down here you kick that open put it on the ground right right there bam here we go check it out check it out you take your boots off Then when you're done, you fold the leg down, you fold it back, check it out, done, you're ready to go. This is just the prototype. So um, that's why he sends to me, there's no logo on it or anything, but check this out, bam. There it is, with the logo and everything on it. It is incredible. It's not gonna be officially launched until June 1st. However, today is the first day that you can pre-order them. And we're selling these things for $97 because, well, you'll, you'll hear my dad talk about it in a second. This thing is so heavy duty and built out of such high quality materials. It's really the only price point that we could have done to make any money on it at all. We're not really not making that money on, on it. So still right now for pre-orders, we're taking $20 off that. So if you guys want something special and want to support the channel, uh, my channel, and also my dad's uh, brand new small business, uh, this is a great opportunity to only $77 until May 1st is what these things are going for. So uh, you can go to jeremiahcraig.com slash bootjack. But before you do that, I want to share with you an interview that I did with my dad yesterday as he explained his process for making the Try Easy foldable boot jack. The COVID has, has caused havoc 
uh, out here. For the companies that are closed due to COVID and for companies like mine who are still open, um, it's been a roller coaster ride like crazy. While the commercial stuff was postponed, uh, we had um, more residential work than we've ever had. You have no clue what it's gonna bring even well into the week that you're working in because everything can stop and then change. And then the next week it changes back again. So we finished up a prototype, I sent it to you. And it is a really nice, viable product. I can get excited about something like this because it's just going to work. When you look at it, it's like, why didn't anybody do this before? You know, it's just one of those simple things that just makes sense when you look at it. It is simple, but it didn't start out that way. Um, I'm a gadget guy. So when you came to me and you said, can we make a foldable boot jack? There isn't one and it's gotta be tough. It's gotta be able to go anywhere and do anything. And of course I realized that you were talking uh, to a guy who owns a fabrication shop. So we're talking about some sort of metal. Um, and a lot of times all you have to do is challenge me and it's like, yeah, okay. So this, this boot jack actually started out very mechanical. Uh, I started to design this with uh, when you open this thing up, uh, everything opens up all by itself and it locks into place. Now you see that this one, when I open it up, the leg stays in place and it's supposed to, but the original design was as you open this up, this leg drops down and goes into place, okay? So that takes gadgetry, and I actually built it. The gadgetry adds a lot of cost to it, okay? And it also adds some mechanical failure in the future. The more parts, so, the more there is the break. Exactly, it's stuff that, that slides, opens, and locks. Um, it's price, it's gadgetry, and in the future, it's wear. Everything that, that moves and opens, it's all wear. So got rid of all the gadgetry. We went with a friction hinge instead of locking mechanisms. You're gonna have to mechanically bring down the leg. It sets down, it's balanced. It has a torque on the friction hinge, the stainless steel hardware on the friction hinge so that it doesn't go anywhere. We have developed a set torque rating so that all of them going out of here are set at the same torque. And they are maybe a little on the stiff side, but that is because these are brand new and they will break in a little bit. So if you don't want to mess around with adjusting the hardware on this, adjusting the hinge, it will break in a little bit. Uh, the important thing is that it's really easy to operate. Let's talk about the price for a second because we decided on $97 for it and that might be a sticker shock to some but when you think about it and for me it's like there are other boot jacks out there going for that already that aren't as durable or as innovative as this but what are the materials that you're using here and how does that reflect the cost of it? This is engineering grade plastic, and it's absolutely necessary nowadays for tough products. It ain't cheap. Neither is aluminum nowadays, and neither is stainless steel. So that's where your price really comes in to this. Uh, the fabricating part of this, we're going to try and make money on volume. We're not making money selling once we're make we're trying to make a little bit selling a lot so the price of this really is from uh, aluminum stainless steel and engineering grade polyethylene they're industrial materials and um, there's some people that might really appreciate industrial materials being used in a boot jack because we're not just talking about cowboy boots. I know your followers uh, are cowboy boot followers. 
I am too. I have uh, a couple of pair of boots, three in fact. I have three pair of cowboy boots myself. But um, let's take it to a different area. Let's just say that you are a cowboy boot wearing duck hunter, okay? So you're a hunter and you put on a different kind of boot for duck hunting. You put on marsh boots, but you don't wear your marsh boots until you get to the hunting place. And you certainly don't wear them back home because you don't want to get your truck all muddy and nasty. So um, this is an area where this boot jack will absolutely thrive because it's not wood, it's tough as nails, and anything boot contact is, is uh, industrial grade polyethylene. So where it contacts your boot has been machined and polished, it won't mark your cowboy boot. You may not care about your marsh boots, but you certainly do your cowboy boots. It won't mark either. Uh, you can take this thing hunting, slip it in the door of your pickup truck. It's very small. When you take off your marsh boots, you open this thing up, the friction hinge holds it open, you throw it down on the ground, you take off your marsh boots, and you put on your cowboy boots for driving home. Um, once you get home, as long as you don't have a lot of mud and stuff in the fork of this thing, um, you can take off your cowboy boots if you want to, unless you have a fancy wooden uh, a boot jack waiting inside the door, which a lot of people have. Um, if this is all muddy, you hose it off. You just hose it off, that's all. And everything comes off because it's aluminum and it's polyethylene, it's stainless steel. Any mechanical attachment on here is stainless steel. It will not rust. Nothing will rust on here. And the polyethylene will certainly last forever. Thanks, Dad. Let's get these things out in the world. You said it. Just like my dad said, you can take these anywhere. You can put them in a backpack. You can put them in your car door. It is a great deal at $77. If you want to pre-order them, uh, all you got to do is go to jeremiahcraig.com slash bootjack and just put in your order. And we'll get it. We'll get it made. Now, we're only doing these $77 per boot jack until May 1st. That's a that's another giveaway day that I'll be announcing this week on my channel. So pre-orders will go until then because May 1st is my birthday. So let's go. Let's go. We got a new boot jack. And there's nothing like that Fits in your car or backpack Yeah, why don't you order a new boot jack today? Yeah It folds Try Easy Boot Jack Thank you so much for watching today I'll see you next time. Peace